Okay. Hello everybody, I'm Paul. Welcome to the channel. This has been something I've been waiting, um, I don't know, a week or two weeks for. By the way, Ben is under the weather with a cold, but working the camera has given me permission to use the mighty leaf knife to open what is fondly known as Betsy back from Fisher Labs. Um, all I did was told him the situation with it. Um, and, and for the newer viewers, what happened last year was I like my F2. I was using it. I didn't have a strap type thing on to keep it from falling in the water. I was detecting in the water and it took a little bath. But it dried out and it was working afterwards. After a couple of days, dried out. Seemed to be working fine. But I did some side-by-sides with my Garrett Ace 250. And I've gotten just tons of, <laughs> not it's, hate it's mail, but fried. people are saying you got to send it in. Some people are like, well, you can't call that a comparison, whatever. I'll put a link to the video. You guys can check it out. Um, I get comments on it all the time. Tons of hate mail on it. Look, I don't care if people buy an Ace 250. I don't care if you buy Mine Lab. I don't care if you buy an F2. I don't have stock in any of them. I don't care. I just was showing the two detectors as I use them, set up how I use them, and that's that. You know, I wasn't saying one is better than the other, and I get all kinds of grief from F2 users saying, oh, you know, that wasn't a fair test to the F2. I prefer the F2. I always did. So anyway, everybody's saying, you got to send that back to Fisher. It's not right. So I told them it doesn't seem like as sensitive as it was when it, First came to us. I've had it a year. I sent it back. It cost me 15 bucks to send it. I think FedEx. I don't know. I don't know what's in. The, I mean, it's my detectors in the box, but I don't know if they're going to say, "Hey, there was nothing wrong with it." I don't know if they're going to have a big bill for me in there. I don't know anything. I haven't opened it. I haven't heard from Fisher, so I just thought this would be kind of a cool video with a long introduction. Let's get to it. I mean. First off, I'm going to take out the packing list because it's got my address on it. So that. And um, I don't know. I, I'm as I'm anxious to see what what it is. If they say anything, I have no idea. So we shall see. You will know as soon as I do. Okay. Packed it nice. So, better stuff than what I get. And okay, here's my coil. It's a new coil. Yeah, it's a new coil. Look. Nice. Nice. Yeah, brand I new mean, coil. because I used the heck out of it. Did they give you sniper. the old one? No, they didn't give the old one, That's which I just so. fine. I don't need it. Yeah. I'll trade uh, an old coil for a new one any day. Look at that. You Banger. can tell. Serial number. Look Let at that. See. Show them real good. Brand new cord, you can smell it, it's brand new. So, here is my F2. And, uh, huh, you put a battery. I sent it, he I took battery the batteries out, obviously. You, you, you put a battery in it? No, no, I'm not saying a battery oh, okay. in it. I'm saying I left this part off because I'd taken the batteries out and it's sitting right over there. Man, this sucker's brand new. It's a new head. It's a new head. Or reconditioned see. or something. I mean, smell it. You can smell it's brand new. Don't drop that bad boy. Oh, yeah. That's brand new. That's brand Absolutely. new. Absolutely. Well, anyway, so, yeah, I figured, like, why send this just extra weight? They don't need it to test it. But, yeah, look at the, I mean, mine was worn. That. So, I don't know, guys. There you are. Oh, it does have a, is it, is yeah, okay. I just wiped it. Yeah. Let me see what the packing list says. If it says anything. Uh, okay, March 7th, 2014. Dear Paul, we received your Fisher Labs uh, F2. Our technician analyzed your unit and determined that your unit was in need in repair. The following corrective actions were taken. Taken. 
Replace the 4 inch coil and membrane switch. Note new coil serial number blah 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 blah. Your unit was inspected by a specialist before being returned. Please feel free to contact us with any questions in regards to that service that was performed. Um, so it was, it's just, uh, no, I mean, no, I mean, I don't, I, I don't know what it's saying. Maybe it's somebody else's. They, they probably take yours and, and redo it or something like this, but, uh. So is it a new head? It's a new I mean, look, they even gave me the screws, which I had the original oh, wow. ones, and these okay. are brand new screws. I mean, you can tell they're brand new screws. That is they're great. Brand, yeah. So he's taped it. I mean, things when they're new. They smell. they smell. I mean, this is just like when you open a brand new computer or whatever, you know. So I don't know if they, I don't know what they do, to be honest. But this has never been in the field as far as I, I mean, I can see. You know what I mean? Okay, well, we have to put it on. Those. I mean, I don't know what my old, I have it recorded, my old serial number, but... I don't know, unless they just replace this part, but I mean, it looks, I mean, it looks brand new. Yeah. It looks new. I mean, here's, is there a little scratch there, but they must recondition or do something with it, huh? You must have new guts or, yeah, re redone something to it. I don't know. Okay. So we'll have to try it out, so, I don't know. I'd say, I'm impressed, aren't you? Yeah, thumbs up. Um, no bill. <laughs> That's yeah. the main thing. For 15 bucks, basically, looks like a refurbished, re reconditioned, brand new unit, whatever. I'm happy. Thumbs up, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, for Fisher. So, um, I don't know, maybe about six months before we can try it out, before the ground never thaws. I'm being facetious, but you get the point. It's just going to be a while. Probably another month or two before I can try it. But I will do some more side-by-sides of Fisher versus Garrett, you know. And um, we'll see, you know. It's, uh, I, I don't know. What else can I say? I'll, I'll give yeah, them the link. Nice customer and, support. Um, so, yeah. Um, evidently, you know, that test, everybody was right saying that something was wrong with it. Um, it was still finding coins, though, amazingly enough, so... Must have just been a little bit off. I don't know how many coins we lost, though. Yeah, how many I didn't, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But, I mean, even the new, I mean, that's sweet. I don't, look at that. That's, Brand new coin. Or at least the cover or something. I mean, look at this. The cord, everything. I don't know why they replaced that, though. There was yeah, nothing no, wrong with it, because that's waterproof. That can go in the water. Yeah, I mean. I guess they just decided fine. to replace everything. Yeah, I mean, the other one, jeez, it had been mm -hmm. used. You scratched, know, scratched, you could out. tell. Oh, <laughs> right yeah. away. They might have replaced a, just the plastic, but... Yeah, maybe they just did that part, but... I don't think it would be worth their, worth their time. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. So anyway, I mean, we're just droning on and on, but a pleasant surprise uh, from from my point of view. Yeah. So anyway, um, we'll let you know as the story continues. I just want to keep you updated on it. Appreciate you tuning in. Thanks for your support, guys, and we'll see you soon.